Now you can tell if a striker player is godlike if they win at a uh, color selection. By the way, so if they lose a color selection, then I mean, they kind of they probably ask. The mothership has told me that this striker player's name is Gamma Male. So let's see what Gamma Male is bringing to the table. And this is a good color. This man just might cook Jerry. Oh, trying to play that neutral. Ooh, that's a good ass roll. Ooh, he got the. Oh, he's safe jumping. All right, guard cancel. All right, Jerry's in a dangerous position, but he doesn't have that much mana to guard uh, guard cancel off of him. So if the striker player starts his offense, he can guard break and pretty much GG's peace out. The round from here. But, uh, 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 uh. That man trying to get some white light. Ooh, 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 ooh. All right, he dropped, but nah, nah, nah. It's over. It's over. That boy playing some good new. Nah, all right. You, you can't be dive kicking from all the way out there, my brother. Please. Oh, no. All right, he got the hit. Oh, 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 oh. That's the confirm? Shoot. I'd go for a confirm that guarantees the kill without question of a doubt. But this will definitely get him to kill as well. That was a riskier route, but he he got it done. He's a braver man than me. So game one goes to Gamma Mail. Let's see how Jerry adjusts going into this round. But yeah, a lot of this round for Striker is just to play the neutral. Uh, she does Striker's DP. I mean, not Striker's DP. Uh, Dragon Knight's DP isn't the isn't necessarily hard to bait out. All you really need to do is just pick your spots on when to roll, just like there, to keep her in the corner, and then just run your offense. The Striker's offense is definitely one of the best in the game, if not the best in the game. Debatably, Swiftmaster, in my opinion, is definitely 10 times better, but it's all debate, it's still early game to have this discussion. But as we have seen, Jerry started his offense, and he just might get the kill if he finishes the route with the super. He more than likely will, and he will get the super, and then now it's one. One, that was an amazing confirm by Jeremiah. Is there a good awareness on his part? These boys are really going down to the wire. I know Jerry was sweating in this game boy god damn that boy that boy is playing forbidden neutral right now look at him back dashing oh uh. but now they're jerry gets the hit let's see he gonna go into some mix no he pops up the corner i know jerry was not ready for that i know but jerry's doing a good job of staying composed and staying on top of the striker trying to make sure that she doesn't start her offense that was a good jump over the 2b Oh, Jerry kind of OD. Oh, combo. Is Jerry going to be a combo breaker champ for DNF Duel? Hmm? We're going to see. Oh, all right. Jerry got cracked open. He got his can opened up. All right, good guard cancel. Oh, Jerry's lucky as hell. He did not have mana to keep that going. All right, that was a good jump. Uh, this striker player isn't really DPing any of Jerry's aerial approaches. Kind of just snipe him on the ground and say jump a lot of the DP stuff. But you got to... You gotta try and DP the jumpings, even though her D Striker's DP isn't necessarily good on its own. It's only good when you're canceling it, so you can have a safe DP for combo and pressure strength. But Jerry checked the button and took it 2-1. Let's see how the Striker player name Gamma Blade adapts going into the next game. So Mother Shit told me his name is not Gamma Blade. My bad. It's Gamma Male. My fault, OG. I should not disrespect a fellow striker player this way, but like I said, uh, Gamma, Mayo, and Jeremiah is there going into the second round. These boys were definitely playing phenomenal. Fun I can't say that word. These boys are definitely playing that guy like neutral. There's little things that the striker player could do to readjust and take home the W with relative ease, because I don't think this matchup is relatively hard for striker. I think it's one of the easier ones, but this is all just, probably just matchup unfamiliar unfamiliarity. So let's see how he adapts going into game two. All right. Now let's see what these boys are up to going into this going into this game. Oh, Jerry just going for pokes. Oh, yep. This is going to be some good damage. Oh, I'm pretty sure there's a rock that does way more. But like I said, Gamma Mill probably isn't aware of the rock. Probably still learning the game, so it's all good. Don't want to be too critical in these lower rank games because that's all lower rank is. Just a bunch of people trying to learn how to play the game. So it's all good. But Jerry with the good confirm 
Is he gonna set up the dragon? Try to go for some mix? Nah, he's just gonna run up. Oh, that was a good ass roll. My man did not know what state he was in after that. Oh, um, but they, they're trying to start their offense, but he's getting all of his rolls smoked by the dragon roar. Which is actually, honestly, oh, he was not. He got his can opened up. And yeah, yeah he's gonna die. Yo. Damn. Uh, I guess for Gamma Mill, he needs to stop going for the roll because Jerry is clearly just calling in. What the hell? <laughs> but yeah, Jerry's clearly calling in his dragon to stop him and all his roll approaches. So he might have to just play this a bit better. He needs to incorporate more grabs to kind of oh, all up start his offense. Yeah, he got guard cancel. I hit the dragon. Jerry rolled. Mm, stuffed it. Don't do it. That boy Jerry is waving a big old stop sign at him. Tell him to hold it down. Oh, mix? Nah, nah, nah. That boy Jerry don't ever go for the low. Oh. Yeah, he's just, just stopping all his approaches. But he dropped the confirm. Uh, we can't be dropping those. Oh, he got his candle opened up. Oh, Jerry got those? Nah, nah, nah. Jerry dropped. Jerry dropped. Jerry needs to be a bit more optimal. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, look at his guard meter, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, uh, but Jerry has a lot of white life. So he can use some conversion mix-up right here. Nah, 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 nah. Did Jerry drop the rod? Not like this. Not like this. Ooh. Ooh. Nah, 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 nah. He kind of OD. Say jump. Nah, nah, nah. Jerry's dead. Oh, and just like that, Gamma Mill takes it. Let's see how Jeremiah goes into the next round. Looking for an adaption. Jerry was on top of him for the most part, but the, when he needed to close out combos, he kept dropping. But he just needs to clean up his combo execution just a little bit in order to get these clean consecutive rounds on players like Gamma Mill. But Gamma Mill isn't necessarily playing this bad. He just needs to watch how much he's rolling and how much money he's using on offense. Only time you should be using all your mana in terms of cashing out is probably when you're going for a guard break setup with Striker, in my personal opinion. Because you always want to keep mana to uh, guard break them off of you so you can start your offense, which is very important for Striker. Because otherwise you get put in situations like these where it's going to be very hard to make a comeback. But let, let's see. Is he going to grab? No, he's just going to roll up the corner. That boy is a brave soul. Oh, oh, Atomo? He dropped the combo. Oh, not like this. He picked it back up. He's gonna cash up with the super. No, he dropped. My man's just trying to mix. He don't care about the win. He's just trying to mix. I respect. Oh, yeah, Jerry's dead. Uh, 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 uh. He's going for the optimal. Nah, my man's keep dropping. All right, he is dead ass not trying to win. All right, and then he got. The shoulder tackle good stuff by Gambit Bill, but I just... Me personally, I don't understand trying to mix him, bro. Like he could have killed him mad times, but like I said, he probably is still trying to put the pieces together when trying to learn this game. So good stuff to Gambit Bill taking this round, and we're going to go into game three. And here we are with the grand finale of Gambit Bill versus Jeremiah Isaiah. Let's see how these players adapt to each other and going into the last set. I think Jerry's going to take it, but Gamma Mill has definitely been looking very promising. He looked like he got the download. My man got gigabit net. He got the download. He got the fast speeds. So let, let's see how he how he gets it going, man. My man is definitely applying the pressure. He's cashing out with his uh, mana a little too recklessly. But like I said, probably at, like I said previously, my bad. That he's probably still learning the game, so he's still putting the piece and cues together. But let's see how these boys get it going. That boy rolled in? Oh, he's reckless. He's approaching a lot with uh, six forward heavy. I still trying to get familiar with the notations. But oh, he's going for the confirm. Uh, 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 uh. In this situation, he does not need to go for a dive kick because he can continue the route if he lands and uses mana for the little kicks. But, like I said, he's probably not aware. Shaka has multiple OTGs. 
for those of you that don't know what OTG means, it means on the ground. So basically, if you're on the ground laying flat, there's a move that pops you up to continue the route. Ooh, uppercut! Hold up, hold up. He looking kind of OD. Garb cancel. He looking optimal. Let's see how we, let's see how they going. Hold up. Nah, nah, nah. Jerry, Jerry's gonna die. Jerry, Jerry's gonna. Oh, nah. I keep thinking he's gonna die because my man's gonna kill, but because he just he just doesn't know the ride of you, man. Letting Jerry get away. <laughs> Personally, with me, bro, I'm trying to kill all these characters. All these characters are cat. I'm not trying to let any of them get a comeback on me. That's just a fact. But, oh? Mix? Nah, no mix. No mix. Ooh. Jerry got the hit again. He's putting that pressure on him. Ooh. 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 Big confirm. Ooh. Uh. Going for the save jump? That boy Jerry just got mixed out his shoes. God damn. But let's keep it going. Oh, oh, oh! Nah, Jerry. My man's gotta tighten up his combo execution. We can't be dropping these. Look at his life! Oh my god! Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. This is a confirmant to super. Oh, but will this kill? I think it'll kill. Striker doesn't have that much HP. I think her HP is 850 or 950. Ooh, she lived. Dash up DP if you bought it. Nah, you ain't bought it. You ain't bought it. Come on. All right, but yeah, game two going to Jeremiah's end. This is now the final game. Let's see how these boys start scrapping. Ooh. Now shoulder. Ooh. In the corner. Uh, uh, uh. Safe jump him. Ooh. Nah. Guard cancel. One man's got to start baiting these guard cans. Ooh! Nah, nah, nah. Jerry looking like a burger right now. All right. Outside interference. Look at him. Yo, DP, get off me. Oh. That man really got robbed out his route because he got shot by the dragon. But yeah, this is definitely big confirm. Nah, that boy Jerry looking out. Ain't no way he's dead. Oh. Nah, he got robbed. <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> well, we take those. Jeremiah Isaiah took game three with outside interference from the dragon. Good shit to both players. Gamma male, Jeremiah Isaiah. Both of y'all did it. Amazing.